Hi everyone, so in this video, I'm going to show you how to complete the secret quest that is uh, available in the newbie area or the first area of uh, the game Tale of Immortal and uh, the proper way to complete it and get an uh, orange ability book right at the start of the game. So after the character creation, uh, you will come over to the town and uh, from there you will come over to the village over here. After talking to the old man, he will give you the quest to uh, defeat the spirit over here. So you just have to come over here to fight the spirit. For the first battle with the spirit, uh, you can just uh, let the spirit win. The encounter will end when you are at half health. Okay, so you can see in half health uh, the encounter will end. Okay, so next uh, you have to go back to town to rest. Come over to the the inn to rest, and uh, you ask you to train yourself. So come over here, train, and you will reach uh, the first bottleneck. So you will meet this guy uh, over here, and he will try to sell you this item where you need to break through your first bottleneck for four hundred uh, magic stones. But uh, I don't recommend buying from this guy, so just uh, say no. Because you can actually buy the same stone over here in town for 300 magic stones instead. Okay, so from here, you can break through the bottleneck. Next, uh, you ask you to buy skill books. Okay, so you can just buy them. And uh, learn the skills. So we can learn the second one as well. Okay, so after finish uh, learning the skills, can equip them. Okay, so you'll say uh, to go back and re-challenge uh, the evil spirit, but uh, don't do that. Go to the tavern. So this is where you get the secret quest from. So you'll talk about a bandit's hideout, uh, so accept the quest. And uh, go to the bandit's hideout over here. 
do a quick save. So I recommend doing a quick save here, uh, so that if you make any mistakes, you can reload the game to come back to this part again. So enter the bandits hideout. So uh, there's two options here. You can choose uh, to destroy the hideout or ask them uh, more about what is happening. Either way, uh, you need to fight the boss over here in order to get the orange ability book later when you complete this quest. So I'll recommend just uh, fighting, but if you want to know more about story, you can choose the second option. And uh, remember to choose uh, this option to destroy the bandit hideout uh, instead of the second option if you choose to listen more to the story. Okay, so uh, yeah, fight the boss over here. Okay, so after fighting the boss, uh, remember to choose the first option. So you need to believe that he has a uh, talent in the uh, cultivation. Ask you to pass uh, some money to his mother, and you also get this book. And uh, remember to bury this guy. So choose the first option. This is a uh, very important. Okay, so next, uh, he'll ask you to go back to the village. So remember to... Not uh, touch any of the items that he gave to you when he died. So uh, when you are back at the village, uh, choose this third option to give uh, 800 magic stones uh, to his mother. Okay, next exit. And uh, go back to the first town. So I will recommend you to save here. Okay, so when you are back here, uh, give everything that you have to this girl. So choose this first option. Okay. Uh, so you can do a save. And uh, you can jump to the end of the month. So actually they will do an auto save over here as well. So you will see that uh, the talisman that uh, the bandit gave you uh, will shine and uh, speak some words. And the talisman will become an orange or legendary uh, ability book. It also give you a 
a passive skill book so this is random okay so both of these are random and uh, this could be from gray to even orange so there's a possibility of getting two orange ability books but uh, this is the key one so you can take a look at the ability book if it's not something that you want uh, you can always reload Okay, so after reloading, the same event will happen, and uh, yeah, we so we can see that the disability books change. So you can just uh keep reloading to get the book that you want. So there's a chance that you will get uh the book of uh from the foundation stage where you can't use initially. So that might be a reason why you want to reload as well to get a training stage uh, orange book or if you prefer you can get reload uh, to get one in the foundation stage and this skill should last you quite a while okay so uh, that and this is how you can complete the secret quest to get a uh, orange ability book in the beginning of the game that will be quite useful uh, as uh, you, progress, you progress through the beginning part of the game. And uh, remember when you want to, you know, on your way back to the main town, do not open up any of the items that uh, the bandit gave to you. So uh, that's all for this video. Uh, hopefully it is useful for you. And, uh, you know, let me know if there are any interest in such videos. So like, share, subscribe so that I know, uh, you know, that you find this useful or there are interest in such videos and I will do more of such videos uh, for you as well. So see you next time on Playing Deadly. Bye-bye.